In Burlington County, New Jersey, traffic is forced to reroute after a sinkhole opened up in Mount Laurel. Drivers are advised to avoid the area near 161 Gaither Drive, where all lanes are closed in both directions. Police advise using East Park Drive and Central Avenue as an alternate route. A landslide has forced families out of their homes. Thank you so much for joining us at 6. I'm Megan Schiller. Kim Gable has the night off. I'm Ken Rice. This is happening in Moon Township. KDK's Jennifer Barrasso is there and has been talking to people who live there. Jen, a nightmare. Flooding has forced the village of Pemberton to declare a local state of emergency. Several properties in that community, about 30 kilometers north of Whistler, have been ordered to evacuate, while many others are on alert. Our Zara Premji joins us now with more. Zara, what's happening in Pemberton right now? Well, Dan, the main intersection is flooded, and there is flooding on the banks of the Lillooet River as well. The state of emergency was declared around noon after heavy rain and warm temperatures caused the creeks and the rivers to rise. Now, the evacuation order has been issued for Singapore. Посмотрите, какое сегодня красивое солнце в Сочи. А вокруг него радужная голова. Необычно. A desperate search at Limba as a swollen six-mile creek turned to river rapids. Swiftwater rescue crews called in as police feared the worst. I walked down to sort of see if I could see anyone in there or see what it was. The Robinson family saw the black sedan and called police. Thankfully, it was a false alarm. The young woman inside had already escaped, climbing out through the boot to safety. You don't expect to see car lights down there. She's one of many drivers caught out. This man is surrounded by a moray field moat, drenched and desperate. He waits on his truck roof for help. When we arrived, we had a vehicle and probably approximately two metres of water. Swiftwater crews come to his rescue, paddling him to safety and onto somewhat drier land. It just reinforces the, if it's flooded, forget it. I'm, I'm not sure why he was driving down there, but uh, it just gets deeper as we go. But moments later, another truck driver tries his luck met with the same fate as the Morayfield shopping centre was swallowed. He's going to be there for the night and if you're milking bread's late, you know why. <laughs> Major roads and thoroughfares cut from Mango Hill to Debra, washing up cows at Bald Hills as northern suburbs received more than a month's worth of rain.